hello guys thank you for being with me in this period now i'm gonna show you how to break the law of basic mathematics considering on one plus one as mathematicians say that one plus one is equals to two mathematicians says mathematicians says now today i'm gonna show you that one plus one equals to three and i'm going to prove it so in this period i'm gonna show you how to prove that one plus one is equal to three now let's be together to solve this problem now let's make consideration that consider one is equal to one in considering one is equal to one now you can say 41 minus 40 this will be equal to the one minus 60 this we are we are not consider that this we don't break the equation this if you minus here you're gonna get one and if you minus here 61 minus 60 you're gonna get one now after here now you can say that in this 41 you can expand the and now after here we're gonna expand this one this 41 41 if we expand this we get this get 16 we get 16 plus 25 if we get, if we combine this with plus this you get you if you find the summation of this and this you get 41 and here now you can expand this you can expand this 41 by 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 taking on another alternative now let, let's say on let's 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 take it as it the, the fourth this will be equals this week you get set six plus with 25 and minus in six uh, after here now you are gonna you are gonna expand this one this in the 16 this you get 40 squared plus with 5 squared after there this you can expand this 40 by taking 2 times 4 times 5 this minus 2 times 4 times 5 this um, after making multiplication here you gain 40 and here now you gain this is the 6 square plus 5 square and here now 6 here you can expand and you get 2 times 6 times 5 you get 2 times 6 times 5 here you get if you ma you make a multiplication here you're gonna get 60 and now now what i'm going to do now you yeah, know now we're going to look on these equations look on this question then by looking consideration of the equation of of perfect square and this equation that after looking this equation here from they say from a squared plus b squared this uh, let, let me let's look on this equation this you get it equals to a squared plus b squared minus 2ab on this question now you can expand this and get the these equations and here now by looking the the law of this mathematics based of this mathematics now you can apply here now instead of writing this you 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 can check this it will be a you can let it in the it will be b and uh, then after you can say that now it will be 40 squared plus 5 squared this will be equals to 40 squared plus 5 squared minus 2 times 4 times 5 and here this is we will make it uh, the perfect in a way you obey the, this equation now and here you can say 6 squared plus 5 squared will be equals to would be equals to six squared plus five squared you minus with two times six times five then after instead of writing this one this is here now instead of writing this which is this one you write this one and then you write this one here now it will be it will be four squared this one will be 
4 squared plus 5 squared it will be equals to 6 squared plus 5 squared and then after after doing a such a such way on solving this best mathematics now what can we do now here this is 5 and this is 5 you can take it run away and then after you you take 4 squared that will be equals to 6 squared and then after you remove this square this square by taking under roots and this in the square roots and this is square roots this will cancel with this one and this will cancel with this one after they are cancelled you can take 4 will be equals to 6 then after you can divide it by 2 both sides resulting in making changes on the equation on the balancing equation and then here you get 2 and here you get 3 <laughs> and now this show that 2 is equals to 3 if if two is will be equals to three now and we, we, we say in the mathematician say that one plus one will be is equals to two. While we say while two will be equals to three. Now also now also one plus one will be equals to three because on this on this calculation they show that you two will be equals to three now this will by if one plus one will be equals to two while two will be, while two is equal to three now one plus one will be also equals to three now this is proved okay thank you thank you thank you now um, on this period now i'm um, on another way i'm gonna show you how to break the law of basic mathematics this on the this period now we are gonna, we're gonna show in that one plus one is not only equals to two but also will be equals to three that's why we're proving it all this calculation that we, we did here uh, on such a case that one plus one is equals to two the mathematics says uh, while one one plus one will be will be also equals to three that's why i'm proving it from here up to the end up to the end here and then we say this hence proved <laughs> all okay thank you let me let me request you to subscribe on youtube channel this uh, we're gonna show you on different ways on how to break the law of basic mathematics on another way you can calculate by using simple curriculum on calculating this basic mathematics on the, the another way is on you can say that basic mathematics can be calculated on different ways on there is a simple way and a complex way to calculate basic mathematics so let me thank you thank you to all of you now subscribe to my youtube channel thank you